What's good everybody? My name is Jay Fatty. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you the settings that I use when I export waves and mp3s. So let's get right into it. So first we're going to do exporting mp3. So we'll go to file, export, mp3, choose your destination. And then here's the settings that you're going to want. You can pause the screen to copy these, but essentially we just want the full song. We want to leave a remainder for the tail. And then we, we have it on mp3 right here. We want to make sure the mp3 bit rate is whatever you want. I normally keep it at 192 or we can go all the way up to 320. 320 is really good. And then you can mess with the resampling if you want. I'd make sure you put HQ, high quality for all plugins, disable maximum poly. And then you got some miscellaneous settings like save playlist markers, save loop markers, save note markers, save the tempo information. This one right here, split mixer tracks, you don't want that on for mp3, so make sure that's off. Trim PDC silence, enable insert effects, and enable master effects. These are very important that they're on. And then once you have those settings, you should be able to export for mp3. Now if we move it over to Wave, let me show you the difference there. So essentially it's the same settings up here, but the Wave bit length right here. You got a 16-bit float. Let's actually bring that to 32-bit float, okay? Now, none of these settings we got to mess with. The same thing here, 32-point sync, high quality, disable maximum poly, and then same thing with the miscellaneous, all of the same miscellaneous settings. Now, if this is just a regular WAV file, turn split mixer tracks off. Now, if you have split mixer tracks on, that's how you can get your stems. So what that's going to do is going to split every individual mixer track, so keep that in mind. And you got to be on WAV if you're trying to split your mixer tracks. You can't do this for MP3. Yeah, just a really quick video to show you the settings that you can use when rendering out your projects. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If this video brought you value, please leave a like, hit subscribe, and hit the little bell. Make sure you stay safe, stay striving, and always be getting it. Much love, y'all. Peace.